Hello everyone, welcome back to Minecraft Survival. Last time we went caving, and um, I've, I have no idea where I came from, which might be good to remember because we did find a zombie spawner. But yeah, as you can see on the minimap, it's nighttime and there are a lot of monsters outside, so we'll go after that. We'll go after that um, zombie spawner some other time. Ooh, almost fell into that hole. Luckily, luckily I can see um, the pathway already that we have built, of course, in the last episode, in which we also went caving. Um, but I've said that already. What an intro this is. Anyway, um, let's eat some steak. And let's uh, put the findings of our, of the mining session. Well, it wasn't mining, it's, it's more so caving. But let's put our findi findings of the caving session in our chest. Now I do, yes, alright. Um, so, as you can see we got 22 of our iron, that's very nice. Um, and some coal, which can go in there, we got a solid amount of cobblestone, some dirt, some granite, pointed tripstone, um, rails that can go in miscellaneous, so can rotten fresh, and the string I want to use to make some, um, this is not enough. But the string is what I want to use to make a fishing rod. Why? Oh, right, I need some more sticks. Now I can make a fishing rod. So we can hopefully fish a bit more. We also got a name tag, which is excellent. Um, got... Those iron ingots were still from before the mining trips, huh? Alright. Then the bone I can put away. Alright, that's fine. I still, I do need to grab some water. Sadly. I guess the closest place to get water is that river. Or that cave right there. Uh, I think that river would be best. Yeah, I'll, I'll go and get some water from that river, but first, um, let me make a new iron pickaxe, because the one in the last episode broke while we were trying to get out. And let's also get some more torches, because we've used an entire stack of them last episode and still ran out. That caving trip was insane, to say the least. Anyway, a uh, bucket. But yeah, uh, you can see it all, it's um, mostly the um, red I have of the episode. I think it starts more or less 10 minutes in, and until the end. But yeah, that caving trip was crazy. Truly insane. And I recorded all of it actually. Um, I do cut occasionally. Well, I, I, I guess they're not as... Not really cuts, more so... Just things I don't record. But yeah. Um, I recorded that, that entire session, so... Yeah, that, that's also why last time was... A bit of a long episode. There's a torch there. And there's a cave here. Hello. Let's not go in there. I also realized that I went in caving without having any water with me, which... Is honestly a bit of a mistake. But oh well. We have made it out, so it's all, it's fine. 
anyway, um, yeah, I, I don't really have much I want to do for this episode. Maybe make an experience form out of the zombie spawner that we um, found last episode. Maybe, potentially. But yeah, I'm not entirely sure. Because a lot of zombies spawn from there, so I it might be good to wait until they despawn. Um, but oh well, that's fine. I can store away this arrow, I can store away this stick. And I think what I want to do today is to make a bit of a farm. The question is though, where? Because this savanna is incredibly hilly, as you may be able to see. So yeah, I could make one into the plains there, but I feel like that would be a bit too far away. So I don't know, there's some flat space right there. Yeah, um, I don't know, well, I could terraform all of this. But also I'm not really in the mood. Um. Also, also, I guess I'll see what we'll do, it's, I'll, ma I'll uh, make a cut and I'll see what we can do. Um, anyway, yeah, see you in a bit. Alright, so right here I have made a bit of a pen, I also have a uh, 2x2 water source, so I can water this area in. And yeah, then we can start on this little farm. Um, I will need a hoe first, so let's go make one. I'm not going to make an iron hoe because even though I have over a stack of iron, I still think it's a waste. So I'll just get some stone, get a stone hoe, and also put that back. And yeah, then we can, right here, can place some, uh, place some water in here, and hold the ground up. Wait, uh, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, alright, so they, these uh, water places can go central, that's good to know. So then we'll have a gap of, how much is that, 3, that's indeed 3, I need some new water, and then another gap of 1, 2, 3, and then 3, that's Fine, I guess. Um, doesn't quite come out right. Speaking of not coming out right, Jesus, that was stupid. But that is fine. Now to just repeat that on this side. And then one, two, three right here. I hate having to walk back to that source, but oh well. So one, two, three, here. I, I feel like, yeah, it's indeed wrong. Here, yes, all right. And then one, two, three, and here. And then the last one at the very end. Ooh. At the very end right here. Excellent. Now we can hold this ground up. 
Maybe I'll still pray some seeds already. A seedy place, how nice. Alright. So now let's tilt the ground here. Be careful not to tilt the pathway through the middle. And Yeah, that's fine. Alright, so that's this side of um, it all cleared. Now, that grass that grows in, I got in the savannah is really annoying. It's been annoying well. While I've been building that pathway, and it's still annoying now, building this farm. But oh well, that's fine. I think I will need uh, a new hoe sometime soon. By sometime soon, I mean before I'm finished with tilting the entire ground. Yes, indeed. That's fine, we can... Seat some more in. And it seems to be time to go to bed anyway. So, yeah. Come on. Get us up there. Can only sleep at night, of course. We can never sleep at a good time. I also grab on cobblestone too much, but... That's fine, I guess. We can put it back into the chest. And that'll be fine. Alright. So, um... Right here, let's continue seeding this place up. Or... Hoeing the place up, I guess. Yeah, hoeing the place up, that seems correct. Alright, that's all. Now I need to get some more seeds from my chest because we have a lot of seeds. We have way too much seeds, honestly. And I, I, I know that technically wheat seeds, but um, they used to just simply be called seeds, so that's what I'm used to, and that's what I'll keep calling them. Um, because yeah, I think that's uh, easiest. Alright. This reminds me back on uh, Keepcraft, a server I used to be in, in which is the uh, Minecraft survival world I actually played on the longest. And this one is the second longest, I think. But yeah, I had a pretty big building. I think it was a little smaller than this, but still fairly sized and multiple floors of wheat farm. That was insane. And it was all fairly densely packed as well. So, yeah. Um, now what I want to do is... Uh, continue our pathway... Down to the... Uh, um, to the... Uh, to our, uh, the wheat farm that we have. Um, yeah, alright, so, I think I want the pathway to go there, so, I'll just have this be a, uh, single wide pathway for a bit, and yeah, alright. 
Alright, so right now I have built this little pathway between my base. As you can see this is the old pathway that already, already exists. And now I have this bit which honestly it's a bit, um, it is a bit windy but that's because that hill was there. Maybe it'd be good to have like Actually, yeah, I'm going to do that right now, actually. Having like a little split off that goes like that. That might be good. I do need a new shovel though. So, yeah. Let's get a single piece of iron. And let's get a new shovel. Let's also get some more cobblestone. And a few more cobblestone stairs. Probably one more. Alright. I should get a stone cutter by the way. It's stone cutters are more efficient than crafting tables. But oh well. Um I'm going to sleep and then I'll work on that pathway. Alright, so as you can see now, I have built this pathway. I really need to clean up my inventory. So I'll do that first because you guys need to go in here. Then you need to go into the wood chest or plant these seeds in a bit. In a bit. You need to go in there. You need to go in there. You need to go in there. I have no idea how I got these bread. Where I got that bread from? Actually no, probably back when we were in the mineshaft. And those seeds are plant later. Alright. Um, sorry, I had to do that. I really hate having such a disorganized inventory. But as you can see right here, I have this pathway that just kinda goes like this, goes over and goes to this into this farm, which doesn't look the best on the minimap, but, you know, it does what it needs to do. And it really doesn't matter how it looks on the minimap, honestly. Alright, that's that planted. Um, and yeah, I'm really happy with this uh, little wheat farm here. Um, I think I will expand it with a potato farm, carrot farm, beetroot maybe as well, and all of that other good stuff. But yeah, we won't do that today. Um, we'll just do that some... Ooh, I need to watch out as to not crush these crops, but... Also, is the, the grass path broke? Brock looks identical to the farmland block on the minimap, which is interesting. But yeah, I'm really happy with this farm, and yeah, I, I hope it will bring in a lot of bread for us, a lot of other items, and yeah, it's great. We also have um, this pathway, which is great if we want to expand the pathway there. So yeah. Um, things are going quite well. Anyway, next episode... I don't know what I'll do next episode actually, but... We'll do something. I know I... Kinda want to go AFK fishing. So... Maybe we'll do that next episode. We'll see. I'll probably do it between episodes, knowing me. Anyway, goodbye.